So we purchased those bricks yesterday, and this morning they're being delivered. Uh, these children are bringing them anywhere from four to five to six at a time. Some one. <laughs> they're pretty heavy. But they've been bringing them for about an hour now, and it's quite a distance from where they are, uh, where they're coming from. They're bringing 400 of them. I know when we uh, when we first purchased these uh, some bricks a while back, I carried one back, and it was <laughs> it was a strange just to, from where they where they burnt these where they made these it was a strange just to bring one, let alone carry uh, five and six on your head at a time. But, uh, Kenyans are strong. They're used to working hard. 400 bricks altogether we're purchasing. It's going to be for the uh, to toilet there, for the walls. Uh, the right one's going to be the toilet. The left one is uh, shower. So the uh, wood's going to go, and the <coughs> water tank's going to go on top of the uh, of the brick building. The kitchen's under construction. It has the roof now. It has two windows. It has a door. And uh, it's good size. It's pretty big. That there is not exactly a window. That's going to be a shutter that's going to open uh, out and up. So, uh, so when, the, when there's a group of people here and they need to be fed, they'll cook in here and they'll feed them through this, through this opening. Outside here, where uh, <laughs> the Amaya is doing laundry at the moment, that's going to be, uh, we're going to level that off and put a couple of tables there. So uh, people can eat there. Uh, of course, that over there is going to get slowly but surely. It's it's been uh, <clears throat> being uh, uh, being uh, it's not completed yet, but it's we're making progress on it. That is going to be the guest house. It'll serve you know, for the feast to house brethren when they come for the feast. It'll also uh, serve during the year when visitors come. There's quite a few visitors come here. They'll walk for days to get here and. Uh, They'll come with a, with, a, with, a, with, a, with a head full of questions, biblical questions, and we'll sit down and they'll sometimes they'll spend a day or two and, you know, we'll uh, open up our Bibles and we'll discuss scriptures and, and uh, now we'll have a place for them to, uh, to sleep if they, when they do come. Uh, also, uh, it'll serve for, uh, for widows and orphans when they get into a spot like we had that one lady uh, who lost her husband. She had, I think, three young children. And uh, she got evicted from where she was living and no place to live. So uh, when we have situations like that, we can put them, you know, temporarily house them in that, in that guest house until we get them uh, to be able to help the widows and orphans and situate them. So uh, slowly but surely, we're making, we're making progress here. You can see our tank, water tank, the gutters around the house. So uh, life's becoming a little more, uh, a little bit uh, easier here. For, uh, for these living conditions of the spread, and especially the, uh, the widows and orphans, it's just been, uh, it's been tough for them. As you know, uh, a few of those orphans just were, they really didn't have places to live. That's why we built that, that orphan house. They were, uh, some of them were living in Charles McCorrow's kitchen on the floor, uh, just on a mattress. Uh, you know, Charles has taken so many orphans in, and, uh, you know, he doesn't, uh, he doesn't have a big place or a lot of money to uh, to uh, to accommodate them too well, so he does the best he can, and he's helped many. But uh, the Kenya Hands of Hope have definitely assisted a lot, and their money has been used uh, really uh, efficiently, and uh, the fruits are there. So uh, you know, we pray all the time for God to guide us, because we know we have to be good stewards with uh, with the funds, make sure they're being used properly, and we keep praying that that God will help us to do just that. But uh, so far things are, uh, things are moving forward and uh, there's quite a bit of uh, progress being, being made right now. So that's my report for the moment.